A ribbon cutting for a new mid Michigan semiconductor facility that's bringing dozens of good paying jobs to the region. As TV 5's James Felton tells us, the company will help the state of Michigan hit its electric vehicle goals. One, two, three, cut. Okay. And with that, SK Siltron opened its new facility in the Bay County community of Monitor Township. Governor Gretchen Whitmer was on hand for today's ribbon cutting ceremony. We're grateful for the leadership of SK Siltron choosing to uh, build this manufacturing plant right here. SK Siltron, which is based in Auburn, announced plans for a second Michigan location last year. The company produces silicon carbide wafers. The wafers are known for their ability to transfer energy efficiently. For that reason, the wafers are a key component in electric vehicles. A more fluid transfer of electricity from the battery to the motor increases the driving range of electric vehicles by 5 to 10 percent. Whitmer tells us she fought hard to secure the $300 million investment. This is the future of technology, of mobility. These are the chips we all rely on and desperately looking for over the last few years. And this is going to be good paying jobs. U.S. Representative Dan Kildee also took part in today's event. This is what happens when we have a, a state government, a governor who believes in the workers of the state and the ingenuity of our people and a federal government that has an industrial policy that says we're going to claim our own future. A future that SK Siltron CSS CEO Chin Wei Dong believes is bright for the Great Lakes state. We are determined to continue to invest in Michigan, take advantage of the great talent and uh, all the resources here to grow this business, to transform the world. Reporting in Bay County, James Felton, WNEM TV5. The new facility in Monitor Township is expected to bring in around 150 new jobs.